At Limeslade Bay, Mumbles, Swansea, and visible from the roadway near Forte's ice cream parlor, you can see a red colored boy with the name Mixon on it. This boy is to warn vessels that there is a dangerous sandbank in this location called the Mixon Sands. Many a ship has floundered on the sands with the loss of life, and as these pictures show the sea can be very turbulent at this spot. If the tide is especially high and goes out further the Nixon Sands can be uncovered. In 1928 this happened, and Lieutenant Commander Douglas Robert, and a Mr. Cleve Matlin landed on the sandbank and played cricket. In 1957 the sandbank was visible again and the people in this photograph went onto the sandbank set up a table and chairs, and had tea and sandwiches. Before the tide turned they had to quickly return to shore. The intrepid group consisted of Derek Scott, coxswain of the Mumbles lifeboat, his father Les, Gwyn John, who was assistant secretary of the lifeboat committee, and his wife, Stanley Poulton of Her Majesty's Coast Guard, Tom Way, Jack Gammon, lifeboat mechanic, Harry Libby who was mayor of Swansea that year, and evening post photographer Harry Hyman. 